Hello everyone and welcome back to the Legend of Zelda Great uh, Fairy Hunting. Great Fairy Hunting, that's what we're doing today. We are going to find ourselves the greatest of the fairies while missing a shield unfortunately because some idiot decided to get it burned by a fire key. Oh come on, that totally connected. Hit it, thank you. Ooh, all the rubies will be mine, will be- <gasps> No! No! I fell down the mountain! Good thing I didn't do that from the very, very top. Alright. It is quickly becoming nighttime, which is not bad, not good. I mean, there's no real pro or con to that here. Uh, what is that? Okay, I mean, I guess we'll go down and see what's up here. Uh... It's a cow, so... Isn't there something with this cow? Let's see. Let's see if we can make it go to sleep. I felt like there was a way to get the cow to go to your house. Maybe it's Saria's song we need to play. I don't recall. I, I think there's a way to get the stupid thing to go to your house, though. No. Oh, I didn't want to talk to the spirits either. The spirits didn't tell me anything good, just to keep moving. Thanks, guys. You guys are very inspirational. Alright, well, let's carry on then. We're gonna go up here to the top of Death Mountain. Right after equipping our slingshot, because that's gonna be an important thing to have. Uh, now, normally... Yep, there it goes. I was gonna say, there's a volcanic eruption that happens. Ah, I didn't even see the... The rocks kind of follow you, and that's... Stupid things? Oh, there were... I don't think multiple rocks should be able to fall on you like that. Okay. That's fine. Just... Please stop, Mr. Explosion. Okay, I'm just gonna eat these hits. I don't even care. Uh... There you go. He's dead. Good. Killed one Skullchilla. Hopefully this one doesn't see me before I get down from here, because if they do... Then you're kind of in some trouble. There we go. Can I get a heart out of you? Uh, I guess. I mean, I did shoot a couple to get you, so that's reasonable. Uh, I could have hit him from way down below. Unfortunately, didn't use my brain on that, but... Ah, boom. Let's get a fairy for the road. Seems like a good idea. No. There we go. I don't know why it wasn't playing. I was trying to figure that out. I'm like, what? No, 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 no. You're only playing one note. Why aren't you playing all three? Uh... Did I catch it? Yes, fairy in a bottle. Now, the thing about the fairies in this game, they seem so much happier. They're nice and bright. Unlike the fairies in Wind Waker, which... No, I don't want to talk to you, Mr. Owl. There's no reason to... T I'll talk to you. Fine. Uh, you've done well to come all the way up here, Poof. This is the summit of the sacred Death Mountain, Hoot! It is said that the clouds surrounding this peak reflect the condition of Death Mountain. When they look normal, it is at peace. Climbing all the way up here just proves how smart you are. Now I want you to see... I want to see you make another smart move. The Great Fairy lives on this mountaintop and she will give you a new skill. She is the leader of the fairies, you know, Hoo! I will perch here and wait for you. When you're ready to go back down, I can help you. Now get going. I'm actually glad I talked to him. That worked out in our favor. Hello, great fairy. I see the Triforce, which means we play this song. And will you come out and talk to me? Miss uh, Polygons? That's what we're going to call her. Uh, Miss Polygon 1. Wait for it. Wait for it. Hold on, guys. Trust me when I say wait for it, and polygons. Nintendo, you did well with polygons. Uh, so this is the Great Fairy of Power. She's going to grant me a sword technique. What is this, like the boosted spin slash? It's been so long. Just light me on fire and raise my health to full. Thank you. Means the lot. Uh, what'd I get? Uh, yes, the spin. Oh? 
already done the spin attack? You want to release energy without charging your weapon? Just rotate and press B. When you charge power, magic power will be consumed. Okay, so before we weren't doing magic attacks. That's, I was like, what is going on? Next time you're in their neighborhood, you should drop in on a friend of mine who lives by Hyrule Castle. She'll surely grant you another new power. And that's actually a rock that we passed, and we'll go there. Um, but it won't be for a while, actually. I don't, I don't tend to go over to her for a long time because there's no real benefit right now. Uh, now, owl, take me, take me back down the mountain, sir. Thank you. Ah, uh, so nice and fast, and not running through explosive volcanic eruptions. Didn't know that that was a thing. Where are you taking me? I want to go down the mountain, not up it, you fool. Take me back down! Thank you. Oh, hey, it's Kakarika. In a weird 2D sprite setting. Oh! He put you up on top of the roof? I didn't... I didn't realize. Well, now we head... Because why not, we're just gonna grab a gold sculptula. And, because why not, we're gonna... Oh, I forgot, there's so many in the town at night. I don't know how many we have, I think we have two right now, or three. We're gonna grab just a couple, because there's some... There's one item that I like to use them for. Oh, that wasn't what I wanted. Uh... Yeah, see, they're so strong, they do a heart of damage at once. Die. Give me your skull, thank you. Now, the other one sits over here during the night. Actually up on top of... Or not on top of, but part way up this ladder. And prevents you from going up there. So let me... Equipify the slingshot. Don't save. I did, I have been saving though, because, you know, don't want to repeat what happened, uh... That time, not to be mentioned. But we're gonna climb, 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 get a gold sculpture. Drop off the ladder. Uh, take a half heart a hit, I don't really care, that's not much. Not when we have five hearts, because we're just that cool. Come over here, and this house. This is our friends, um, some of you might know them, some of you might not. The freaking terrifying monsters. Uh, they were, oh, okay. Cool. These, this was a ri family of very rich people. Uh, and I think these guys, yeah, Yarg, I'm cursed. Okay, we haven't done even close to enough yet. I don't remember. I think it's 10, then 20, then 50, then, I don't know, 100. Uh, but they give you stuff. And they were cursed because they were too greedy, essentially. A person was like, oh, you're too greedy, I'm going to curse you, and turn them all into spiders, because apparently spiders are greed? I, I don't know. Uh, and yeah, I don't, it's just weird. It's strange to me. Strange and unusual. And I, I try not to... Pay too much attention to it, because the thought of being turned into a spider is kind of interesting, isn't it? I, I don't know. Oh boy, we're heading to a river. And it's very important, because you don't have a choice on how to play this game right now. While there is an open world, and you can't adventure, it, it's very linear on the levels, to a point. And later on, we'll talk about that point, because I don't play this game quote-unquote normal. Um, I play much differently than most people tend to do. Oh, yes. Got the magic jar to fill our heart, or fill our magic. Okay, I was... Woohoo! Looks like you've gotten bigger and stronger already, Wolf! Just ahead lies Zora's domain. The Zoras serve Hyrule's loyal family by protecting this water source. That door will not open for anyone except those who have some connection with the royal family. Let them hear the melody of the royal family. Hoo 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 Uh, yeah, no, we, we only play the melody of the royal family everywhere. It's just how we row. Hear me, owl? I ain't concerned. I've got connections to the royals and to their family. 
<laughs> it's this guy. It's our magic bean plant friend. Jump, jump, jump. How about some magic beans? They aren't selling very well. How about 10 rupees? I will buy. I'm actually going to pick up a couple here. Will I? Eh, no. I'll just do one. Uh, and we can put one down here, actually. So let's... Just throw it down. They're for later use. But anytime you see soft soil like this, you can plant a magic bean. And they have a purpose, and like I said, we might... Uh, we might come back and revisit this guy later. Just all depends on what we decide to do. No, 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 no. Oh, I didn't clear it. Didn't clear it. The moment you touch the water, you're done. D-U-N, done. Unfortunate that our Deku shield got burned uh, by some, for some unknown reason. I don't know why that happened. Very strange and unusual, but... That's that's the life we gotta. Okay, why can't I do this? What am I doing wrong? Why is my brain not properly functioning? Okay, come back. Give this another shot. Come over here. Did they change it? Do you have? I don't think you ever had to use this cucko. We're gonna try it. I mean, I don't know. Did you? I, I really don't don't recall if you had to or not. Hey look, it's the blue tech tykes that I talked about. Uh, we're gonna come over here just because we'll get, we'll get a heart piece while we can. Might as well, right? It's not gonna kill us. Uh, and in fact, we'll help extend our lives. Oh wait, that's not right. We're not gonna get a heart piece. I'm off on my uh, judgment. Okay, go. Shut it. Shut your trap, you stupid bird. Okay. Uh, hmm. I have made one large miscalculation. Actually, I haven't made any miscalculation. You can go this way still. Not the way that you're supposed to go, but you can do it like that. Okay. So now we should be heading towards where we need to, right? I hope. We don't have the shield that we need to be able to bounce those back, and I, I do feel bad, because someone made such a big mistake on that and just completely ruined everything. Hopefully this works. Yes! I didn't even know that uh, Skulltula would... Oh! Oh! I'm so scared of getting swept away by the current. Okay. We got the gold Skulltula. Which, like I said before, just nice to get uh, for... Actually, what you'll get from it eventually is... A large wallet. Or... As the... Oh, no. Okay, why isn't it playing... My up is not registering. There we go. As I was saying, the adult wallet. It lets you hold more rupees rather than the 99 that you can hold right now. And I think this game might have the steepest and most harsh limitation on how many rupees you can have uh, at the beginnings. Oh, that just tells you it's the sleepest waterfall. Only will respond to a lullaby or something like that. And we happen to know the perfect lullaby. Rats! I don't want to, but we're gonna have to do something unfortunate here. And that's something, if I can get over to the land, is use our fairy. Makes me cry. I'm sorry, fairy. I didn't want to use you so soon. I needed you for later because I'm terrible at this. Uh, but we need to grab a fish. We need to come over here, and you can pick up a fish. Oh, nope. You can pick up a fish. There we go. I was like, no way. Oh, that's awesome. I love the little fish's icon. That's amazing. Uh, and we have to go up into a mini game, actually. So there's... Well, it's a quote-unquote mini game. It's not really a mini game, but they treat it like one. 
Uh, this is the big kingfish who we'll talk to later. He's a good friend. Good friend. He's a good guy. He's, he's I mean, he's a nice guy. I don't know if I'd say he's a good guy. Doesn't pay much attention to his children. Diving game. So you gotta pick up all of the rupees that he drops. Now, if you do, he'll give you an award. Problem is... Link, as it stands, is a terrible swimmer. And can only go underwater for three seconds at any given time. Uh, I like how they make you pay... Oh... No. These guys are bad carnies. They make you pay... Ah! No! Dive and swim. Swim out. Thank you. Uh, they make you pay 20 rupees, but then let you get 25 if you win. I mean, I like their style. Uh, he's got something very nice for us. Come and get it. Fine, we'll go talk to him now. Everyone just wants to be talked to up in this place. They got... Hey! Play this game. Oh, rather than come down and congratulate you, I'm gonna make you climb the trek all the way back up here even though you took a long swim and you're human. And I know you can't swim very well. Okay, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to make you climb all the way up here. And then, you know, it's just... Link's just sick of it. He really is. Sick and tired of their bogusness. Hello, sir. What do you got for me? What a graceful dive! Now please take this, it's a scale of our kind. With this, you can dive much deeper under the water. So we got the silver scale. This is apparently a scale straight off of their body, kinda disturbing, uh, but it lets us dive for five seconds instead of three. And why might that be important? This right here. You, or, oh, I'm sorry, I was wrong, it lets you dive for six seconds. Wow, I thought it was five. Six seconds, not three. Uh, which lets you come to Lake Hylia. And you might actually be able to get here on the three second dive, but you cannot get down deep enough to grab this bottle. And I didn't have to use my fairy. Ah, you got an empty bottle. Use it with- What? Something's already inside? Oh, how interesting. So there's already something inside this bottle, and that should not be. There should be nothing in that bottle. That bottle was empty, it said. Why is it an empty bottle if there's something in it? I don't understand you game logic. Or rather, Nintendo logic. It's okay logic, I guess, but not great. Uh, so what's inside? I guess I should bring that up. What is inside the bottle is what the king wants to see. Well, doesn't really want to see, it's what he's gonna see, though. It's a letter from his esteemed daughter, the princess. And you go up and show it to him, and he'll get a little disgruntled, I believe. So let's go see. Hello, sir. I would talk to you, but you're just gonna be like, blub, blub, blub. Swap that out for the fish. And... Oh, this letter. It's from Princess Ruto. Hmm, let's see. She's inside Lord Jabu Jabu. That's not possible! Our guardian god, Lord Jabu Jabu, would never eat my dear Princess Ruto. But since that stranger Ganondorf came here, Lord Jabu Jabu has been a little green around the gills. <laughs> the evidence seems clear. Of course you'll go find Ruto. You can pass through here to the altar of Lord Jabu Jabu. Keep this letter. You keep the bottles and take it respectfully. Uh, please find my dear Princess Ruto immediately. Zora. Weep. 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 Yeah, this is... <laughs> This is why I never talk to him. He talks slow to begin with. And then the one thing you actually need him to do for you... Is this. And it takes 10 years. So how you guys doing? How's your days? Uh, my day wasn't too bad. I've been kinda... Kinda busy, you know? Gearing up for that time of the year again. It's just like... Whatever. Watching giant... Uh, creepy looking fish... Frog man. Ribbit as he turns sideways. Oh, oh, he's done. Let us move then to the altar of Lord Jabu Jabu, where we will be leaving off for today. Verily. Ah, so peaceful in the open air. Zora's Fountain. Lord Jabu Jabu is. like the largest godfish you will ever. No! What? I didn't- I didn't just run the wrong way back into the thing. At least you don't gotta watch the cutscene again. 
Alright everyone, well thank you so much for watching. Uh, next time we will pick up in front of Lord Jabu Jabu. Hey old man. As always, I'm Grey Wolf and I'm out.